Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm just going to be doing uh, a bit of an update video, um, just explaining why I've not really been uploading a lot um, in the past week or uh, so. Uh, so yeah, this is just going to be a little bit of an update video. So the main reason that I've uh, not been uploading a lot um, is the fact that the YouTube cap trap doesn't work anymore. They've decided to discontinue it, I think. Uh, they've not got a new update for their iOS 11, which I installed. Uh, so I don't think that they're going to do another update for that, which is a bit annoying. Um, so I've had to just find another way to uh, record videos on my phone. So the ways I've managed to do this is I basically just, instead of doing it straight from an app, like v recording not from my not from not from my camera app from it from the YouTube capture app. Instead, I just record from my camera app and then just put them all into one segment and then just upload that as a video so um basically i've just been trying to find a way to do that um but works properly and uh yeah i think i've got i think i've managed to do that so yeah, sorry i haven't been uploading a lot but um that should i should be uploading uh more from uh from now on right so to get into the second part of the video i'm actually going to be doing a review of the leads game that i actually vlogged part of um because basically my phone went out which is a bit annoying so i only managed to get um and managed to get one goal. I did actually get the second goal. Well, I did get a second goal, but it was given offside, even though it wasn't offside. And I didn't explain that it was offside. So basically, the second goal that you saw in that video was offside, and it didn't count. But the second goal, well, we got two goals from Gary Hooper in the first half, um, and then we got a goal in the second half from Kieran Lee, which is absolutely unreal. If I, was, if I could have caught that Kieran Lee goal on camera, phew, wow, it would have been so amazing. You know, we just... The ball came in on the half volley on the edge of the box and just whapped it. Whapped it? <laughs> it's a bit of a weird onomatopoeia, but he just smashed it into the bottom left-hand corner and um, no no chance for the keeper. So reviewing that game, um, it's it's good. It was a good result. We played well. It was just a bit frustrating that, you know, we can't we can't do that consistently this season, especially against, you know, United um, the other week. So regarding Man of the Match, I'd actually... I give it to Hooper. I mean, they did anyway. It was on TV, and they give it to Hooper, who's got seven goals in seven games now. <sighs> I just outstanding. He's such a such a good striker. Not only scoring, but um, linking up play as well. You know, he's without him, he's a he's probably the biggest cog, the most vital cog of the Sheffield Wednesday team. You know, I think we need him more than anyone else at the minute. You know, I think you know Westwood wasn't playing, and Wildsmith was fine. You know, I think. He's getting older, he's getting a bit more experienced, you know, I'd definitely start to give him a few more games now, um, now that he's getting more experienced and Kieran West was getting a little bit older. So I think the, um, I think, the, I mean, the first 20 minutes we were, from what I saw, until we scored the first goal, they looked like they could have scored. Yeah, we had a couple of chances, but they like they could have scored uh, to make it 1-0 to them, uh, against Leeds, by the way, if you haven't said that. Um, so I think they could have scored early on, but we scored our first goal. We really got our mojo. Then we started attacking, attacking, attacking. We got the second goal. And then in the second half, we got the third goal in like, the 80th minute, but I mean, the game is pretty much as at that point anyway. And then um, in the last minute, Gary Hooper hit the crossbar, which he probably should have scored uh, to deny him his hat-trick chance. And I've never actually seen a hat-trick from a Sheffield Wednesday player in my entire life, so I wish I wish I could have seen that. And then actually, that's the end of the that part of the video. I'm gonna actually move on to something else, which is very very exciting to tell you that the next week in next weekend Saturday, 3 p.m. kickoff. I'm actually going to my first away game of the season. The first away game that I'm gonna actually it's not the first away game. I'm gonna vlog the uh, Huddersfield one. It was the first away game I vlogged, but um, I'm going to Bolton uh, because. Why not? Basically, I'm going with my dad and uh, my brother, so hopefully that should be that should be quite good. I'm gonna vlog that, and uh, hope they can get. I want to get. I want to manage to record most of the important things because I've never really had a vlog that I've recorded all the important things. You know, I mean, either my phone's died, not enough storage left, forgot, or whatever. So um. So yeah, hopefully I'm going to try and I'm going to try and uh, vlog as much as I can as I make sure I have a full battery uh, for recording it. So that's going to end up this video, guys. And if you did enjoy, then please do like and subscribe if you haven't already for more future content from me. But I anyway, know, yeah. See you later. Bye.